This is a little compilation of some pretty creepy videos I found on the internet the past couple weeks. A TikToker by the name of Eon June was exploring an abandoned nursing home one night for the thrill of it, planning to post it to his TikTok. Little did he know he'd capture more than he bargained for. In the darkness, he could see a figure further down the hallway walking across, and immediately knowing it looked like a person, he turned around and left. After getting home, he tweaked the brightness of the clip, and this was what he saw. So he returned to the nursing home later that night with a friend this time, recording once again, trying to catch something else on video in that same hallway. This is how that went. I swear I saw something down there. Zoom in a little bit more. I'm trying to. Right there, right there, right there. See it? Remember? What the? Oh, what the? I saw, I saw that. That was actually a person. Bro, I'm not joking. Let's get out of here. Come on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Do you mind? No, dude, that's oh, yeah, now, now you're scared that there's... That's actually a pussy. The two are both apprehensive about moving further into the hallway where there was once again a black figure seen walking into one of the adjacent rooms out of sight. I can heal him down there. I'm not fucking playing. I can't hear anything, dude. <laughs> you're an idiot. You're fucking crazy. No, I'm not. Getting to you 100%, but walks past again? It's a real pussy. This, I'll throw you at him. Whatever it is. Just... As the two friends are making their way back out of the hallway... They hear a terrifying scream that barely sounds human, and the video cuts right there. Yeah, there's nothing there. Hey, let's go. Alright. I know I saw something, and I know I'm not fucking crazy. <laughs> Security guards can see some pretty creepy things while working the overnight shifts. In this video, a security guard is left confused when he learns of a new employee he wasn't informed about. However, when he's shown the security footage capturing his perceived interaction with the new employee, he discovers something pretty terrifying. Hey, watch this, y'all. This man, he called his boss asking him, why didn't y'all tell me they had a new employee, right? He constantly looking back, right? He talking to somebody, right? Just watch, this is creepy. Look. Having a kind of whole conversation with somebody, right? Saying that somebody came and he dapping that person off and everything. Now see, look, y'all see when he dapped them off? Look what happened. He dapped them off. You see that shadow? And then the shadow goes over here and he pulling the chair out for him. He swear, he swear to God, he sat there and had a whole conversation with this person. He moved over talking to him and everything. This apparently isn't the only time this exact scenario has happened. In this next clip, which was filmed by a co-worker of another security guard through a CCTV feed, the guard can be seen talking and gesticulating as though having a conversation with someone in one of the building's corridors. Who is he talking to? When asked by a co-worker over the radio who he was talking to, the guard replied that he had been chatting with a woman named Miss Abigail, who had asked him about a man named Mr. Griffin. Dispatch to 329. Griffin, Mike, okay. Yes, sir. Who are you talking to? I'm talking to a early lady. I saw her walking by the store and uh, she said she's looking for Mr. Griffin. Her name is Miss Abigail. Did you say Miss Abigail? Yes, ma'am. She says she wants to see Mr. Griffin, and I told her that uh, the canvas is closed, that she should come tomorrow morning, and she might see Mr. Griffin. Are you sure you're saying Miss Abigail? Like, she's been passed on for two years now. Am I here with that, please? Miss Abigail is, she, she died two years ago. You mean you can't see the person I'm talking to? No, there's nobody in front of you at all. 
As his co-worker quickly pointed out, however, Miss Abigail had died two years prior. In the comfort of his own bedroom, a young man is practicing piano, ironically the Silent Hill theme song, when he sees this. If you didn't see it, look closer at the reflection in the TV screen. black figure can be seen sitting on the bed in the reflection of the TV, but when he turns to look, and when he turns back to the TV, the figure that was there three seconds ago is no longer there. Witnessing this while practicing the theme song to Silent Hill would surely be an unnerving experience, to say the least. A man starts to hear his wife's voice calling him from downstairs. The problem is, the man is home alone while his wife is away on a trip. She hadn't been home for two weeks at the time this was recorded, and he should have been home alone. Along with the calls from his wife's voice, there's the repeated sound of a door being slammed shut. A security camera in the house shows another angle capturing the door making this noise, being opened and closed seemingly by itself. While all of this is going on, the rotating horse carousel music box in the TV stand starts playing music by itself. Some people suggest this could be a skinwalker, disguising itself as the man's wife. Others suggest it's just a straight up demon, which was summoned by using the Ouija board also tucked in the bottom of the TV stand. Alexa, turn on all lights. Whatever it may have been, it sure made for a creepy video. The Kinect was a discontinued accessory for the Xbox 360 and Xbox One. It contained an active sensing depth camera using structured light and a color camera. It was intended to be used as a controller-free game controller, tracking the body or bodies of one or more players in its field of view. The Kinect is able to pick up when a new person enters the room and recognizes body shapes. In this video recorded by a man's Kinect camera, you can see him going to sleep on the couch as the Kinect camera produces a stick figure that tracks his movements. However, at some random hour in the night, this is what shows up in the video. It seems as though someone materializes out of thin air and approaches the man sleeping on the couch. The figure leans over watching the man sleep and then slowly and ominously approaches the camera before the video ends. Oddly enough, there doesn't seem to be any other actual person physically in the room besides the man sleeping on the couch. So what exactly was this connect picking up? A TikToker named Cass started uploading videos showcasing an Annabelle's Hugs doll she received as a gift. The doll was purchased on Amazon, and right from the start, Cass felt like something about the doll felt alive. You guys, I didn't buy this fucking monkey. 
It was a gift. So you could stop asking me why the fuck I would buy the monkey. I didn't buy it. The person who bought it got it off of Amazon. It's an Ashton Drake doll. And um, maybe possessed as fuck was not in the description. So you guys, I just noticed something crazy as fuck. And you're all going to think this is so insane. But I just took out the certificate of authenticity for her. And you're not going to freaking believe the name on this thing. Are you shitting me? Perhaps just an unfortunate coincidence that the doll shares the name of the popular horror movie doll, but it is definitely something to acknowledge after seeing this video that Cass recorded of her taking the doll out of the box. Oh my fucking god, I swear to god this thing just fucking looked at me, oh my fucking... The doll's eyes momentarily turn to look right at Cassidy. What makes this even more disturbing is that the doll's eyes are not supposed to be able to move. Also, for the people who say, oh, just, her eyes are supposed to move, I have those dolls, when you pick them up, their eyes move. Her eyes aren't moving. They ain't moving, unless she just blinked right there, I don't fucking know. If you have any creepy videos you want to send me, check the description for my email.